when building up a turbo or GT3 block, it's a good idea to check the oil squirters. This is one of the oil squirts up there. What this does is it squirts oil under the bottom of the piston. When they're removed, these are the old ones that I took out. Basically, it's a tube with a ball bearing and a spring in it. The idea of the spring is that it needs a certain amount of oil pressure to overcome the spring so that you're not squirting oil when it's at idle with low oil pressure and with low oil flow. So the old ones have been removed, new ones fitted, and now I want to test them. So this on this half of the block, the drillings for the oil squirt have basically run through to here. Probably can't see it in there, but the drilling basically comes out part way, part way down here, um, and then it goes through to the squirter down here. So what I'm going to do is squirt in compressed air into here. Um, but if I do that, it will just come straight through into this hole here. So what I'm going to do is just block that up. And all I've got is a, a drill here, which I've put a bit of um, insulating tape around just to get it to the right diameter and a bit of uh, loom tape just as a stop. So I'm just going to drop that into the hole like that. And that's basically blocking up the hole here so that I can then test the squirter. So to test it, I'm just going to fill it up with a little bit of fast release penetrant and then put some compressed air through it and make sure that it's squirting out. So I'll then repeat that for each of the three in this half of the block and then I'll move on to the other half which is slightly different. Now moving on to the second half of the engine block. The design on this side is slightly different because there is no oil feed hole for the, um, there's no uh, main bearing oil feed here. So the actual hole for the oil squirter actually goes through there. So what I'm gonna do is feed the compressed air in through the topper here and block up the other end of this. And to do that, I'm just gonna put a drill in it so this drill will drop in from underneath and fill the the hole up so this is a 13 30 seconds imperial drill um, which is a, a close enough fit that it allows the air pressure to build up for the oil squirters to operate 